Okay, so I'm playing a game called Marvel Strike Force, and I've been playing this game for literally three years and one day. I just thought I've been playing this game far too long, and I've not really utilised it to help anyone out. Just thought, let's just get on with it. So, here's my first video, and so I'm going to start off with the basics. I'm going to start off with my roster. I've got my starred characters at the top I mean when you start I mean the heart little thing there and in this case it's anti-venom and I'm trying to max it out in every single part here and trying to get him to tier 15 um, so that yeah I can play him in dog dimension 4 because he's supposed to be really good but um, I'll get to that in a bit so here's my characters and my roster again 99% of it is all being free to play just paid for the odd things here and there. This is my roster, and I will go into detail with it some other time. For my stronger characters, especially, just to show what kind of power levels they've got, attack, and all that kind of stuff. <coughs> so, I've done a lot of maxed out characters, as you can see. Uh, some quite a way to go yet. And so anyone with the orange one means I can level them up. Like for example, this one, I'm trying to get it to seven yellow stars. I can get that through the Blitz store, but I have to do it through the orb. Yep, so here we are. Still got a few characters yet to unlock. My main one is Dr. Doom. Oh yeah. Need to get this one and I will very shortly I'm on Dark Dimension 4, which I'll play in this video. <clears throat> and just advice, even if it's obvious, always do your daily campaigns. Um, objective, sorry. Uh, blitz, you know, make sure you're always on top of that. I'll go over it some other time. Yeah, I've just, just done the battles and I don't want to use my Blitz credits for this one. I've already got it maxed out. But in this case, I've got 31 teams. Here's a quick brief look. So just that you want teams, I'll go through it slowly some other time. And I keep playing with it, even if it's a very weak team, there's like no need for it kind of thing, like 12,000 power, that's like nothing. <clears throat> it's still worth getting the extra points because it actually helps with this tier thing over here. Eight being the max. Um, yep, so, yep, there's quite a lot to go through here. I've got 4.84 million. Um, and I've got a lot of uh, power orbs, I'm sorry, gold orbs, I haven't even opened. 83 in this case, which I will do probably straight after Dark Dimension 4. I just wanted to just build it up for fun. Um, and here's my current stats. And I get a chance of it, there we go. So my current power is 8.5 million. My strongest team power is 842,000. So basically roughly 10% on my strength is actually in the top five um, and funnily enough I haven't even put them all at the highest levels <clears throat> so I can easily improve on that here's my current collection power rank that's my rank my strongest alliance that's where our alliance is there we go we just need a few more recruits strongest team I'm the top no twin where, where are we 26,000, I'm sorry, 20,695 in the world and 10 million players, free to play, it's not too bad. And again, I've not really gone maxed. So for example, I can play up to level 84 at the moment. My top lot are, here: yeah, Captain Marvel, Mr. Sinister, Black Bolt, Ronan the Accuser, haven't even maxed him out and he's level 83, Ebony Moore, 83 and so on. <coughs> Yep, anyway, so um, I always launch uh, alliance raids. Um, there's one to be loaded up in a bit, I'll do that after. But I always try to go for the top, yeah, in this case I am. And I always try to get over the 60% mark, in this case we might not be able to make it. It's alright, try the best. Um, okay, just for today's video, I'll just start off with the Dark Dimension. And it says you require gear tier 15. Now just briefly, this one 
dog damage in one not really a big deal nowadays most people can get through that without any hassle i hope um let's see what we got it's been a small one <laughs> 20 minutes i didn't remember that one okay um <clears throat> eleven thousand. not too bad so yeah in this one all you need is six star characters which i can do with most of my team now actually how many stars have i got so out of my current 173 characters collected there's a few more to be collected i got 102 which ain't too bad my all-time arena rank is 65 so okay it's not that good um what mvp is 34 that's all right uh yeah talk dimension <coughs> we got dark dimension 2 that's the one where we get ultron and the second time you just get a bit more stuff um this one i yeah, that one's not too bad, really. I'll probably do that some other time for fun. See how I'll get. <laughs> one day, 9 hours, 39 minutes, 10 seconds. Yeah, I'll easily beat that. Um, Dark Dimension 3, it wasn't too bad. Let's see where I'm at. What? 10,000? That's quite high. 10,000. I haven't even played that properly. 22 days, I'm surprised. <coughs> Currently on... Dark Dimension 4, I haven't completed it yet, but as we can see, if I go on to it, I'm pretty much towards the end. Just got four nodes left, and on this one, I've only got a few characters to beat up yet. And I know that Emma Frost is going to be the biggest issue, but before we get there, that's the Dark Dimension 4 that I've completed so far, so 73.33%. Anyways, for now, let's just start off with it. So, we've got all the great characters taken out the ones in color are the ones that we're going to face yet in different waves <clears throat> uh, my last tech was not too bad it wasn't a one shot but it was all right um, and if I just launch this what I've done is I've spread my five current legendary non-legendary city characters and in dark dimension 4 you need four characters so I've I've got my symbiotes uh, MB anti venom is supposed to be the better one um, to use in this one, but couldn't get the resources yet for that. That's why it's still pending right there. And the Scream's supposed to be good. Um, the new team H4H is pretty good, but I haven't got that. I haven't resource put my resources into them. Anyway, Night Nurse. I just got seven stars in red, so I thought why not? And Punisher just because I just had the resources. Very <laughs> low strength, really. Um, <clears throat> if we just start the fight, let's just get on with it. Oh yeah, they load. There we go. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm just going to skip that text. It basically means anyone with this color thing going on in their heads. Iron Man and this guy um, basically got some extra powers going on at the moment. Something like that. It's not really too fussed about that. Anyway, I'm just going to attack Rescue because in this team, she's going to keep healing or clearing out any negative effects and I just want to Heat them up yeah just got battered with punisher losing its life straight away and i'm just going to just do ability block and with venom being a striker is going to attack twice with that purple thing now gone now i'm just going to just survive as long as i can on this and just clear out as much as i can okay we've got some breathing space let's make the most of it i'm going to attack venom because i feel like he might ability block me in the worst time Maybe he already has. On Night Nurse, yep, yeah, gone. Now I'm just gonna go to that character there and might no sorry, just just rescue. With the three hearts three bleeds, sorry, and a defense down, and I'm gonna spread it by using no oh god, it's gonna miss. Blind. Okay. After all that. Um Okay, just stun this dude. That's gonna help us out. <coughs> Okay, so rescue is gone. That's a good sign. And if I attack Punisher, it's not the best one to attack yet. But by bleeding him, you'll see. No, maybe not. Okay, I'm going to have to save it for the next time. I'm just going through these nodes at my own pace. And I'm not going to overpower these, like using this best attack here now. Because it will help, but it will just basically be a wasteful when I need to. On the next round, I'm doing this at my own pace. Like I said, it's free to play style. 
So I'm just gonna get battered and I just have to witness that on my first video. Yep. Unless Spider-Man symbiote does something about all of them, which is not gonna happen. The good thing about the symbiotes is every time you attack and get a negative on them, you heal. Not that it's gonna do any difference, there you go. <coughs> so yeah, that's a defeat. I normally restart it and all that kind of stuff, but this is the end of the day. The, the health recovers in a bit, so I'm not going to waste my time stressing. I've just done a 2.32 million attack, which is so alright. Let's get on with my life. Anyway, um, we've got a war going on, and I'll show how my teams are positioned soon. Uh, but for now, I'll just start off, start off with that. I will be posting more videos with more ways to show how I can build my team. And I've got a lot of resources for a lot of things. My focus is on this character, just because she's just so strong. Um, try to max her out on here as well, on the ISOs. Try to max her out most of my characters, they've got loads of maxed out stuff. I'll go through this some other time. Yep, so there you are. Over and out.